Hello, I'm Matteo, the Chief Mobile Opinionist here at Tech Travel Geeks. And in today's video, we are going to look at a power bank I purchased on Amazon. It was on a special offer, and as well as that, there was a 10% voucher off. So I thought, what's the harm in having yet another 10,000 milliamp hour power bank? And in this case, it's one which also happens to be MagSafe compatible. So you can use it to charge devices that have MagSafe cases. It's very handy for traveling. So here we are, packaging arrived like this in its usual brown box from Amazon. And I'm going to use my Jerry Rig Everything knife to cut through the tape that's holding on to the box here. There we go. And we'll see what's in it. It's generic packaging here. It doesn't have many details of the product itself. Oh, there's nothing actually in here to take out. Or is there? Here we go. So this is uh, definitely a power bank. Uh, this should be the MagSafe compatible side. And at the bottom, you have little details of the, the product. So the brand, as seen on Amazon, is called Poitel or Poitel, not really sure how to pronounce that. And apparently this is a 10,000 milliamp hour power bank, which does uh, both input and output through USB type C. It has a little power in LED power indicator here. I'm going to take the plastic covering off. One. And two. So I'm going to take the plastic coverings off and you can see the LED little lights give you an idea of what the state of charge is. So it's not quite full, but almost. Um, and it feels as if it's made of metal. It is. It's a metal frame. Uh, this is obviously a nice little hardened plastic on the magnetic side. Same on the back. It has a handy little kickstand so you can put use it to keep your phone upright whilst using it. And uh, there is also a secondary USB type C port. My understanding is that both do power in and out. But what I'm going to do is take this away on an upcoming trip. So I'll be in traveling throughout Europe over the next few days and uh, put this power bank through its paces with my Google Pixel 9 Pro XL and the iPhone 15 Pro Max. We'll see how, uh, how this battery handles charging those devices and more importantly, how well it charges overnight in terms of how speedily it does so. Anyway, um, whilst I'm here, no chamfered edges here on the sides. Um, this doesn't seem to be actual MagSafe certified. It's not a for Apple product, but I'm imagining this should be okay. Right, okay, so this was quickly the unboxing. I'll be back with my full review soon. Okay then, it's been a few months since I've been using this Pointel or Poitel uh, power bank uh, with both devices with magnetic bags and ones that don't, such as in this case, the Infinix GT20 Pro, uh, Pro, which I'm currently in the final phases of review. The power bank works exactly as expected, uh, both when using it with magnetic devices and when using it with the USB Type-C port. It charges fast. It does a decent job of handling heat. After having tested this in August and September throughout different European countries, I can quite confidently say that this is a good power bank for travel. It is slightly on the pricier side of the the market, considering that it's not a made for Apple device. So it doesn't have any certification as being made for Apple devices. So for the MagSafe uh, claim, take that with a pinch of salt. It's got all the magnets, but it's not really made for Apple. So if you're looking for a decent power bank with the magnetic capabilities, a little kickstand for maybe using it to charge your device and use it maybe on a train or aeroplane uh, seat table, this is a pretty decent option. I will keep this in my bag. I think that 10,000 milliamp power with these characteristics, you're getting relatively good value for money. 
So I'll leave a link in the description to where you too can purchase this Poitel or Pointel uh, power bank uh, from Amazon here in the UK. If you think I've missed out any details, if you'd like to know more, please do leave us a comment in the section below. As usual, here at Tech Travel Geeks, we cover consumer electronics, gadgets, accessories, and anything else we think makes the travel experience better. And as usual, thanks for watching and see you soon.